Welcome back. I'm Wayne Garcia. A driver is facing charges tonight, including manslaughter and DUII, after investigators say he hit and killed a student in a crosswalk in Gresham. Police arrested Garrett Bergquist after they say he ran a red light and crashed into the boy. Fox 12 Zach Anders spoke with the boy's family tonight and shows us the memorial near the crash. It's been an emotional day here in Gresham as family, friends and neighbors come to mourn the loss of a young boy, an 11 year old who was walking to his middle school just a few blocks down the road before he was struck and killed by a DUI driver here on Hogan Drive. A young man identified by the family as 11 year old Luis Javier Medina was walking to Dexter McCarty Middle School Monday morning. He used the crosswalk at Southeast Hogan and 5th Street and waited for the signal. But a driver, according to police, ran the red light, hitting and killing the boy. Police say 26 year old Garrett Bergquist was behind the wheel. They say he stayed at the scene but appeared to be impaired somehow. He now faces charges of manslaughter, DUII, and reckless driving. It's scary for me me and I'm the one that is already lost. Darla Sturdy is a member of Oregon Families for Safe Streets. She lost her son in a crosswalk 16 years ago. Her own grandchildren go to the same school that Luis Medina did. She says hearing the news broke her heart. I feel bad for the family. I've been there. I've been through it and I'm sorry. And I am trying my hardest to make it better. Monday night, Luis's father, Bartolo, in the beam of headlights, shovel in hand, builds a memorial for his son, killed while walking to school. The suspect in this case is expected to appear Tuesday afternoon in court. As for this road, neighbors tell me that this is the second fatal collision with a pedestrian on this road in the last several weeks. And they're hoping that something can be done to try and make this road safer. Reporting from Gresham, Zach Anders, Fox 12 Oregon.